Hello, welcome to Voxember. This is day number four. Yes, number four. I'm filming this on Sunday. You're gonna see it's on Monday, and I'm filming it the day before. And I'm wearing my, um, I'm representing my home team for football NFL. Sunday, I'm wearing my Dolphins shirt. That's why I'm wearing this shirt today. I'm gonna represent my home team, the Miami Dolphins. And I want to show you today the haul that I've been promising you for a few days. My Sephora um, haul from the Sephora VIP, VIP sale. I have stuff from Sephora, from Nordstrom, from Ulta. I think from Ulta. Yeah. And Beautylish. And I have everything in a big bag. It's quite heavy. So that's why I left it for a dedicated video. Because I wanted to show you everything I got. More goodies for me to try with you guys. I'm going to take out everything one by one and show you what I got. I'm going to start with Sephora. Remember the VIB sale for Rouge members like myself, it was 20% off. And Sephora items were 30% off for everybody. So I've been wanting to get this brush set. This is the Pro A-Piece brush set from Sephora. These are the brushes that it comes with. Let me take it out of the box. And it comes in its own little case, which is super cute. So I don't have to take out the brushes one by one. i just show you what this set looks like. I'll take these out and throw the covers away, but meanwhile, you guys get to see the brush set. I did see them in person, and they were really soft, so let's do one, just so you see how they look and how they feel. Really soft. So I've been wanting to get this set for a long time, and I waited for the sale. I also picked out the cleansing balm from Tatcha. The indigo cleansing balm another item that i've been wanting to get in the sephora sale i got things that i've been wanting to get and i don't i don't i didn't get any backups i just got items that i've been eyeing for a while and had in my wish list so i was waiting for the sale to get them and this is one of them the tatcha cleansing balm it's so pretty i love their packaging i also picked up the Tarte Maracuja Lip Plump, the um, the set. Not only because it comes together, it's already at a discount, but also um, they're additionally discount because of the 20%. So I think these were like 50, these are $40, but two free lips. So I'm guessing like you get two, four for the price of two, plus a 20%. I think it was a really good deal. And I am really curious to try these out. I also picked up the Anastasia Beverly Hills Glow Seeker Highlights. This I want to see. I did swatch it in person, but still, I want to show you guys. Such pretty packaging. And look at the highlight. Look how pretty that is. Wow. I wasn't going to swatch it, but I'm really interested in I mean, I already saw it in person, but I'm just going to swatch it to show you guys what it looks like. Look how pretty that is. You guys see it? Oh, it's gorgeous. All right, I picked up the Merit Solo Shadow in the shade Viper. I have it already in the shade Studio and I wanted to get the shade. I, I remember now, I went, I've been, I went twice to Sephora and I didn't find it the first time. And then I went the night before the sale was gonna be done and I found there was one left. And the other and the other Sephora that I went. So this is the single eyeshadow. I got the green one. It's called Viper. It's like a military green. Excited. Okay, I also picked up the Makeup Forever Aqua Resist Smoky Shadow. This is something I got as well the second time around because I didn't have it the first time in the first in the other Sephora. This is also like a green, a green shade. Let's see if I could open it and swatch it. Green is my favorite color. That is gorgeous. Look how shimmery, how beautiful that is. Oh, well, this was like a impulse kind of thing, like right before I got on the line. I got this from Touchland, the Glow Mist Revitalizing Hand Sanitizer in the scent Rose Rose Water scented. Um, it's a thirty-two dollar value, but they were selling it for twenty-five plus a twenty percent off. So I I like these. I used to have one years ago, not years ago, months ago, and I don't remember the scent. It must have been more than a year ago. I don't have it anymore. Like I use it all up, so I, I wanted to get this. This is really good, like for your purse. So I picked up two. So then that last time that I was there, the second time that I was there in Sephora, I got the Huda Beauty Pretty Grunge 
eyeshadow palette, but I already did a re um, review of this palette. I've used it a few times already. It is a gorgeous, gorgeous palette. I really love this palette. And I picked up a Danessa Mavericks Color Fix in the shade Glaze, which is the clear one. Or is it Glaze the name? Yeah, Glaze is the shade name. I have a bunch of colors, but I was missing clear. And I wanted clear. So those are the items I picked up from the Sephora sale. And then we're going to move in with Ulta. Ulta picked up a few things. <laughs> As you can tell. Some of these, I think all these were... Uh, by by um, online. I mean, I mean, I've been in person, but they didn't have the shades of stuff that I wanted, so I ordered it online. Let me take everything out because there are a few things in here. Okay, I ordered the Urban Decay Naked Quickie Concealer. Um, I've heard so many people talk about this concealer, and I wanted to give it a try. I picked up the shade 10 NN, which is ultra ultra fair. Might as well take another box. And this is what it looks like. I also picked up the Hourglass Veil Hydrating Skin Tint. Another thing that I've had in my wish list for a while. So I finally picked it up. I did. Uh, I picked up shade 3. Hopefully it will be a good match. I'm not going to swatch any of these because then I don't want this video to be too long first. And then second of all, I want to be like for a surprise like when I actually do the review. Um, kind of keep things a little bit in the surprise for you and for me. I've been curious to try this. I saw it in, in the website and I was like really curious to try it. It's from Revlon. I usually don't do affordable brands, but Revlon has a few good items that I really enjoy. Like their highlighter is really good. So I wanted to try their blush. This is a powder blush in shade, oh, baby pink. I'm really curious to try. And these are new and I'm also curious to try another affordable brand, Maybelline. The Superstay Vinyl Ink, I picked up shade 95, which is Captivated, and 25, Red Hot. Everything I show you eventually, if it, I mean, I don't know when I'm going to be doing, I'm going to be do the review, but definitely I'm going to be reviewing everything because I bought it because I want to try it, obviously, and I share everything with you guys. All right, and this is a new mascara that I've seen it around, and it looks really interesting. I'm always up to try new mascaras. This is from L'Oreal, the vo voluminous, vo voluminous Panorama. I'm going to try this mascara. It's really pretty. And I pick up, picked up from NYC, I'm oh, sorry, NYC, NYX. <laughs> the NYX Professional Makeup Limp Pencil in the shade Peekaboo Neutral. The reason why I picked this up because you'll see in a few seconds, I got a few things from NYX. So I wanted to try the lip pencil as well. And from Anastasia, Beverly Hills, their Sultry Palette. I went, I've been crazy the last few days and I bought a bunch of things. Look how pretty this is. Ooh. It's just that I can't like stay away. I was hesitant of buying it, but it is so pretty. And I have um, a good experience from a couple other palettes. So really curious to try this one. Beautiful. Beautiful nude palette. And I got a bunch of, not a bunch, two of their, um, the NYX lingerie, their lip, it just says lip, professional makeup, the matte liquid lipstick. I got shade Getting Caliente and On Fuego. Beautiful orange and a red orange, which those are my colors. And this brand I've never heard before, but I liked um, how it looked in the model and i want to try it it's from pound cake it's all actual I, I, it's also a liquid lipstick and it's the shade maraschino give it a try and i have two more lip glosses from nyx or liquid products from nyx it's the pumping lip color in the shade besos and beach casual And with the purchase of a NYX, I got this this gift. It's a bunch of things. It's like a face spray. I can't really tell what it is. Oh, it's a, a setting spray. And I have the pore filler primer. And it's like another lip product. And this blue box is a like a eyeliner, a liquid eyeliner. That was a free gift with purchase. And I also have a bunch of um, samples, perfume samples, because I caught I got the. Prada candy, Prada candy. 
this was like heavily discounted on the website i don't i think I, the day i got it i did open it and i wanted to smell it to see if it was a good choice and it is it smells really really good the bottle is beautiful and it was like heavily discounted this is like a 60 something dollar perfume yeah it smells nice and it was um and it was discounted to like 30 something i don't remember the price but it was like 50 percent off so of course i it was an impulse buy but i'm glad that i got it because it does smell really nice and with that perfume purchase i got a bunch of perfume samples i got the yso libre the armani my way the alien mugler this one is lancome is it it looks like the lancome bottle but i'm not sure the name is so small in the bottom it looks like the Lancome one. Yeah, it probably is. And this one's the most, Azaro, the most wanted. Oh, and more, one more from Ralph, Ralph Lauren Rob's Club. And I got this mascara. It was in the box, but I don't remember if it was Ulta or Sephora. It's the Lancome Idol Lash Lash Lifting Volumizing Mascara Waterproof. I do like the original one. And a friend of mine told me that her favorite is the waterproof version. So I went and bought it, bought it to try it out. So that's all I got from Ulta. A lot of things. I don't remember. I mean, it was like a while ago. I don't remember if there was a sale or it was just something I just wanted to get stuff. One or the other. I don't really need an excuse to <laughs> to buy perfume or buy stuff, makeup. Oh, now I have perfume in my fingers. It smells good. I smell good. Next items I want to show you are from Nordstrom. No judging here. We are all in this together. No judging. Um, Some of these items are most... Are things that I've wanted that I had on my wishes, and then Nordstrom had a sale, and I have there were things on sale, and I do have their, their credit cards, so I had points, whatever. I got a bunch of stuff from Nordstrom. This is the Chanel Natural Finish Loose Powder. I've never tried the Chanel powder. Excited for this. Okay, and this is something that I did not get in the Sephora VIB sale. I was hesitant. But then I got it in Nordstrom. And it's the YSL Couture Mini Clutch High Intensity Pigment Longwear and Comfort in the shade or in the color story Stora Dolls 100. And I've been saving these items to show you guys all together in a haul. But I've been really, I've been itching to try these quads. Look how pretty that packaging. Probably seen it, but I still want to show you. Look how beautiful it is inside. This was like my favorite of the ones that YSL came out with. And it's a little bit smaller than I would think. Like I was thinking more like the Tom Ford quads, but a little bit smaller. But it's okay. I like the packaging. It's really pretty. And speaking of Tom Ford, I did pick up their Soleil Neige. Soleil Neige? Yes. Eye color quad and also their glow highlighter. This is another item I was hesitant about, but I saw uh, Michelle Wong. She did a review. And she convinced me because they were so looked so pretty. It comes in a little white sleeve, and this is what the quad looks like on the outside. And let's look at the inside, which is really what I'm interested in. Let me take out all these little applicators, which I don't use, and the cover. So pretty, look at those shimmers. I'm like a sucker for shimmers. Isn't that right here? Isn't that gorgeous? And wait till you see the highlighter. I mean, probably seen it in other reviews, in other videos. But you haven't seen me try them on. So if you're not subscribed, subscribe. So whenever I have new videos, you guys could see it. And I'll be reviewing all this stuff, all these products really soon. Same packaging as the Soleil, as the Quad. And look up. I'm going to swatch it because I swatched the ABH one. And I'll put it right next to it. Oh, they're, they're very similar, but the Tom Ford, which is this one, it's a little less gold than the ABH, and it's a little bit more rosy. And the ABH is a little bit more gold. Hopefully, you guys can see it. You see it's a little bit more gold. This one's more a little bit more champagne-y, rosy. But they're very similar oh beautiful so i'm a huge fan of the chanel uh le rouge duo 
and there was these two shades I didn't have in my collection so I picked them up it's shade 102 which is milky blueberry and 176 burning red I have daring red I've purchased it twice already but I didn't have burning red this is the milky blueberry and then this is the daring red it has like a, a burnt orange red oh I love these these are my favorite when I want to wear something that I know it's not going to transfer and I'm going to have it for a long time this is what I wear I love these the next thing I want to show you is from Christian Le Bouton <laughs> Christian here I went crazy because I have never tried these and I bought a bunch of shades which maybe I shouldn't but whatever that's the way I am when I like when I get something I get them in different shades I got the Rouge Stiletto Slim Stick Glossy Shine I got four of them let me unbox them and show you guys one by one the shades I picked up these are the ones that look like this it's gonna be a little bit hard to store them but I'll find a way it's just pretty it's just something pretty to have this is the way they look And I think I might swatch them. You want me to swatch them? I got four of them. I got shade Bear Rococoquette, Rouge Le Bouton, Coco Rico Pink, Rouge. I got two Rouge Le Bouton. I can't believe this. I got two of the same color. Yeah, I got two of the same shade. Well, I hate returning things. So what I'm going to do is just include this in the giveaway. How about that? A surprise gift for you guys. That's not what I was intending for today, but I'll include it in today's giveaway. Let me just swatch the three that I'm keeping. All right, so from here are the three swatched. From left to right, we have the Cococat, yeah, the Bear Rococat. In the middle, we have the other Coquet one, Cocorino Pink, which is more like a red, not really that pink. And the third on your right is the one I got twice is the Rouge Le Bouton, and I'll be giving one of them to you guys to one of you so there you go really pretty at Nordstrom I also picked up three new lipsticks I think these are limited edition and I don't know they're still available the Le Fito Gloss Le Fito Gloss from Sissy Paris I got shade Twilight Star and Sunrise so look how beautiful these are they're so pretty. I love their packaging. Sissy Paris has beautiful packaging. Let me swatch them. Okay, here are the three lip glosses. The one on the top is shade number three, which is Sunrise. And then, let me see the names. The reddish one is number 10, which is Star. And the other one is number four, Twilight. Really glossy and shiny. And the Sunrise and Twilight are shimmery while wow, the red one is just glossy you guys see it i don't know if the camera's picking it up i picked up the tory birch essence of dreams this is just a travel size a small size because i wanted to try it and i um i got to sniff it already and it smells really good very fresh yeah it smells fresh let me spray it a little bit just so i get a better idea if the box gives me the notes, yes, vibrant and rapturous, the energy after a storm, an unexpected mix of refreshing cactus flower, lavender, and wood. Yeah, I smell the lavender, but it's very subtle. It's not too strong. It does smell a little bit masculine because of the wood. It smells really good, very fresh. I like it. Maybe I wear it now. And I also got a little one from a little... Uh, the smaller size of the YSL Leap, although I got a sample at Ulta, but I didn't know I was going to get a sample. This one doesn't give me um, much detail of the actual the notes and all that. It doesn't tell me. This one's a little bit more sweet. More like for nighttime, in my opinion. Yeah, it's a little bit sweet, more stronger, more... I don't know. Like, the one from Tory Burch is, like, fresh, and this one's more, like, a little bit more exotic, like, for nighttime, like I said. But it smells good. That was delicious. And I got something from Westman Atelier, the I Want You Mascara. I'm not going to open the mascara yet, but this is what the packaging looks like. I love the color. It's like a bright orange. Love it. And then this was like a last minute impulse thing. <laughs> I got from Maison Francis, Kritchigan, Paris, the Paca Rouge 540, but this is the 
sparkling body oil if you know the scent of baccarat rouge then i love you know how it smells like how it's going to smell i love that fragrance and i wanted to get this one for a long time i've been eyeing it for a long time let's shake it it's not a spray. Let me see how sparkly it is. If it really is sparkly. Ooh, I like it. Like it's not an oily oil. And it's not like too sparkly. Actually, it's not sparkly at all. But it does leave your skin soft. And smelling like Baccarat Rouge. Oh my god, I love this. <laughs> I'm in love with this. Oh, at the Tom Ford, they gave me a little lip color this is the scarlet rouge which i have a bunch of these scarlet rouge is actually one of my favorite colors from tom ford so this one since it's just a sample i'm not gonna give it in the giveaway i'm just gonna put it aside maybe for my mom or something i want to give i would like to give full size items for you guys all right let me put everything back in a bag before i break something and then the last thing that I want to show you today in the last haul uh, or order that I want to show you today is from Beautylish. I picked up two of their, I've already showed this on Instagram and, and my shorts. This is the Souffle eyeshadow from Surat. I picked up shade Gris, Gris Du and Matin Vert. Mat, mat, I'm trying to say it in French. Matin Vert, which is green morning. Or green afternoon or whatever green something and uh green green do this is the the product that looks like jelly i haven't tried it yet on my eyes which i am very soon i promise i just have been cut up with things but this is the one that looks like a like a jelly it's like a really weird texture but they're pretty pigmented like it's really interesting and i've said it really a bunch of times but it's like a jelly but it's pigmented it's interesting i'll be using it soon in a get ready with me i just wanted to show the product before i i try it on i picked up this duo from abh i've been into abh a lot lately this duo luster what's it called i want to say it right the lip luster duo i picked up these two shades these are guava and deep taupe so this is guava and this is deep taupe they're really glossy and shiny and from Wayne Goss, I, he came out with new brushes, but I only picked up the eye set, the E's, E1 through 6. I haven't used them yet. This is what they look like, and these are what the handles look like. I am a huge fan of his brushes, and I'm so ha happy that he came back with brushes. And that's all I picked up from Beerlish, and that is all orders I want to show you today. It's a lot of things that I have to try, and I, I have really have to make myself do more videos, more content for you guys to show you. So I'm going to pack as much as I can in December and in January to show you everything. And speaking of wing goss, I do want to talk to you about the items that I wanted to include in the giveaway. I already uh, mentioned the Cuisson Louboutin lipstick because the Stiletto because I purchased twice and I'm not going to return it. I don't like returning things unless I really have to. And might as well just give it to one of you guys. You guys give me so much support. That is the least that I could do. And from wing goss, I want to also give you this was already originally thought for this day the wayne goss the luxury cream lipstick in the shade macadamia and the essential lip pencil in the shade sepia i'm gonna give this to you and from merit the bronze balm and the brow 1980 which is like the the pomade for the brows these are the items i originally wanted to give to you plus now you have the stiletto really really cool so i am really excited to share what i'm gonna mention tomorrow for the giveaway so stay tuned for that all the details of the giveaway i did mention it in the first video so if you haven't seen that video go back to it and read the description um since i have a long list of items that i did in this haul i won't have space to give you the details for the giveaway so i'm gonna be mentioning it only once in the first video so go to that video and read the description it's really easy to participate and that is all i'm saying like it's nothing it's a lot of things i'm really excited that i was able to share these things with you and excited to see you here i hope you enjoyed this video and i'll see you guys tomorrow bye